Hey, what's up guys? This is Casey Ferris. Thanks for checking out another video of mine here on YouTube. Today we are talking about a really cool feature in Resolve that lets you kind of experiment with different color grades without messing up the one that you're working on. And it's called versions. It's really powerful and I'll show you how it works. Here I have a nice aerial shot of the beach. Let's say I want to put a LUT on it. I'll put a LUT on from our Griffin pack called Caroline. Do a little bit of tweaking under that LUT. Let's say I like that look, but I'm not 100% happy with it and I want to kind of play around with something else. This is just my first idea. If I open up my clips here, right click and go up to local versions, I can hit create new version. And what that's gonna do is make a duplicate of all of these nodes and everything and it's gonna save it in a different version for this shot. So just for clarity, if I make this super purple, I can switch in between my versions and whichever one I have loaded is the one that shows. This is really great if you have a couple ideas for a look or if you wanna give somebody some options for stylizing a piece. So I'm gonna reset this one. Maybe I want this to have a little bit more warmth. There's an idea. And if I wanna add a new version really quickly, what I can do is hit Control Y and that's gonna add another version. Here you see I'm on version three. Now let's say maybe I want to use a different LUT. So we'll use the door LUT from the Griffin pack. Now we have kind of these green undertones. And let's say I like the green, but I want a little bit more contrast if I hit control Y. And you can remember that by thinking, why don't we try something else? Now maybe I'll add a little bit of contrast in this curve. See how it looks. And I can move really quickly between my versions by hitting control N or control B. So I can just hit N and it will load the different versions and I can quickly figure out which one I like the best. I think I like this one the best. And you can even right click and go into your menu here and rename your versions. So this is green with contrast. Version one I'll call standard. You can even name them fun things like the baby's diaper or Uncle Wally. And then if I hit N, it will tell me green with contrast is loaded, standard is loaded, the baby's diaper is loaded, Uncle Wally is loaded. And you know, you can kind of keep things light during your color sesh. <laughs> Anyway, there's a quick, simple way for you to play around and experiment all on the same shot and go through your different options and kind of release the creativity there. That's been really helpful for me. I hope that it's helpful for you. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comments below. If you like this, hit like and make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want more videos on post-production, color grading, DaVinci Resolve, those types of things. But I think that about does it for me. My name is Casey Ferris. I will catch you next time.